Um, Madam Mayor, I have a question. Um, several of us observed you coming out of a closed door room with Veronica Neb, the city attorney, as well as Kathy Capriola. And I think it's only fair for all of us to hear what was discussed sure. um, and what was said in that meeting. And actually, Veronica, I'm not sure if that's even legal because of the, um, you know, we all council members and the public should hear what the questions and the answers are not just a small group in a closed door room. Let's have Veronica answer that. So the, the question, and, and uh, I, let me come back to the question of, um, I was asked a question um, as it relates to uh, negotiations. One of the things that had come up during this conversation, both with, from the community as well as from the council, was could the council uh, change the terms of this agreement as it is currently before you if you did not agree that the terms um, that are before you were appropriate. So the question that came up was um, how, would we, how would that happen if it were to happen? Um, the only way for that to happen is to ask the employee uh, or the employee in question whether they would be amenable to changes. So it, it is appropriate to ask those questions. Um, excuse me, I'll finish the conversation, sorry. Um, it is appropriate to ask that question. Certainly if there is um, to be any changes, we would need to ask the employee if they would be amenable to those changes. My question, though, is that why was the question asked behind closed doors, and why wasn't the question asked in a public venue um, asked, with all the city council members could hear it? I asked. Uh, I wanted uh, to talk with Kathy to see how she was feeling, and I wanted to get get Veronica involved. So I, I'm I, sorry. I was no distracted word. by a question yeah. over here. So could you, I'm just, just repeat. No, all I, I said was I'm the one that asked to speak with Kathy. I wanted to see how she was feeling about everything going down and discussed, and I brought you in on the conversation. That is correct. And what was the answer? I mean, do you have a yeah, I can meet with whomever I want. I didn't have three council members in there. I had the... Um, but, but we're talking about an issue, and if questions are being asked in a private venue behind closed doors, all of us have the... Um, uh, responsibility to know what those questions are. I mean, I, I felt really awkward when I when I saw all three of you coming out of the closed door room. I said, what was being discussed without the rest of us being privy to that discussion? So I, I'm very concerned about the process. Um, and I don't think there's anything illegal in what we did. No, and again, if the council wants to have a discussion about what was asked, I, we can do that. I don't have any problem with that. Certainly. But, but, but I think we need to. Um, I would like to know what was discussed behind closed doors. Um, Madam Mayor, I think we're getting way off topic, and I'm prepared to move on the item. Okay. Is there a second? Second. Okay. Okay. Um, and I, I have a comment. Um, you know, this is the kind of thing right now that we're hearing that, frankly, I think is cr trying to go off topic and make it look like and that there's suspicion and backdoor dealings, and that's not the way our city operates. And frankly, excuse me, 